Yo, I compared my pictures from last year to my pictures from this year, my last year's Christmas photos to this year's Christmas photos. And I was like, oh my God, why did not anyone tell me how much weight I gained? Hi guys, it's your girl Keisha Dixon. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time here, welcome. I'm so glad you guys found my channel because on this channel, you will be coming on a journey with me as I lose weight using currently the medication Manjuro. Now today's topic is a bit bittersweet because I'm hoping and praying that this will not be my last dose of Manjaro. It's the holidays, the new year is approaching and I would be so happy and I would feel so blessed if I can get another prescription. I also want to give you guys my current weight and just give you guys some updates of what's been going on in my life these last couple of days that I haven't been posting. Uh, I do have a touch of laryngitis, so bear with me on my voice. I have to speak very monotone. You know I come to you guys and I tell you guys everything because you are my Manjaro family and there are some things that only you guys will understand. So we have a few things to talk about. If you're interested in what this video has to bring, Stay tuned. Hi, I'm Keisha Dixon. You made it here, so go ahead and subscribe and click your notification bell so you don't miss any of my future uploads. First and foremost, guys, I want to say happy holidays. I hope you guys had an amazing Christmas because me and my family, we had a wonderful Christmas. I did work Christmas Eve, so I came home and brought in Christmas morning with my family and the very first thing i did to wake up my house was make some organic um holiday potpourri so i made a christmas potpourri and i used fresh cranberries rosemary oranges apples cinnamon nutmeg and cinnamon powder and i was heavy on the powders because my ceilings are so high i wanted the fragrance from the um, organic potpourri to raised all over the house and I wanted that to wake up my family. It was something that I did new this year and I was really excited about it. And also for those of you guys who don't know, I'm trying to get into um, home decor content and uh, I've been doing fairly well on Instagram and on Facebook. I actually got a contract with Facebook and I'm actually getting paid for my content. So if you guys aren't following me yet, and you are interested in home decor, check me out. I'm on TikTok at, I'm also on Facebook at, Instagram at, yeah, so check out my home decor content. It's really fun. You guys know that I am a nurse by trade, but sometimes you just wanna do what makes you happy. And I love real estate, I love home decor, and I've been dibbling and dabbling in that and now I'm getting paid for it. So check your girl out. I also put my links in the bio if it is just easier for you to get the information there. Now, guys, our Christmas photos. Oh my God, my Christmas photos turned out so amazing. Y'all, I compared my pictures from last year to my pictures from this year, my last year's Christmas photos to this year's Christmas photos. And I was like, oh my God, why did not anyone tell me how much weight I gained? Like, did people notice? Was anyone concerned and just didn't want to say anything to me? Like, I literally did not look like myself. And you guys know, when you gain weight, sometimes you look in the mirror and you're just like, God, I don't even recognize this person. Like, that literally happened to me when I was in Miami. I didn't get that till I was in Miami and I had to put on a bathing suit and I saw how big my frame was. And when I saw how big my frame was, that made me pay attention to my face because I naturally have this pie face thing going on. But in Miami is when the light bulb went out for me. But this had actually been going on since the end of last year. No one, not even my husband. Now, fun fact about my husband. He has always loved me on the chunkier side. Like, he's into big girls. He like big girls. So, y'all, am I going to lose my husband? Because, <laughs> baby, 
she ain't gonna lose this weight. So somebody gotta get their mind right. Like, I don't know, that's something that we have to figure out because he's like, man, you're getting so thin. And I'm like, I'm getting thin. He was like, yeah, you know, he's like, I think this is enough. But guys, I feel like I have at least 40 more pounds to go. So, you know, I never make you guys wait to the end of the video. This is my current weight this morning. And guys, listen, for the holiday, I really have been doing the most. I've been drinking wine almost every day that I'm off just because I'm happy. You know, my husband's happy. My daughter's happy. You know, her childhood best friend is here. Like the house is so happy. So I've been celebrating and I've been drinking Stella Rose. You guys, I've been putting Casamigos in my Stella Rose. Now, I don't know that Casamigos has carbs. I know the Stella Rose does, but I'm not sure that Casamigos does. So just so that I'm only drinking a glass or two of wine, I spike it with Casamigos. And so you guys know the last time we got together, my weight was 188. It's 189 now. Guys, I made gumbo for Christmas. It's so good. Oh my God. I took the girls out. We had Korean corn dogs. I had um, tonkutsu, which is ramen. Now, mind you, I can't eat all of these things. Like, I never finished my meal. Never finished my meals. But the fact that I've been able to indulge for the holidays and the fact that my manjaro is like uh-uh girl not me girl not us girl so my manjaro has really been keeping me in touch with what's r the real truth like what we're really trying to do here like let's not go off task too much okay class let's get back in order manjaro is like honey she don't live here that 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 greedy girl that indulges in all of these all of the things no longer resides here she doesn't she moved and i'm like okay that's right that's right lieutenant so but the fact that i've been able to you know go out there and splurge on some things has been making me so happy so guys listen instead of taking my manjaro Instead of taking my Manjaro on Tuesdays, I started taking it on Thursday to kind of push my dose out a week. And now I have one dose left. Today is Thursday, so I'm going to take my one dose of Manjaro today. And I'm going to reach out to my nurse practitioner. I know he already is going to write me the script. I'm going to talk to him about the compound form of semaglutide. I hope I'm saying it right. Because that's where I'm going to go after this when I can no longer get this. Now, I will present my uh, prescription to my pharmacist at Walmart, and mind you, he told me that he will grant me my script as long as Eli Lilly does not um, reject my coupons. So guys, is this gonna be my last dose of Manjaro? Am I gonna be stopping at Manjaro 10 until the new medication comes out? That remains to be seen. I'm gonna take you guys on that journey with me as I get that script filled at Walmart and I'm gonna show you guys exactly what happened when I present to my pharmacy. So they're either gonna reject me, they're either gonna ask me if I'm diabetic, you already know how I feel about that, but I'm gonna be recording that whole situation so you guys can see how my pharmacy has been moving, okay? Now we did Star Wars Christmas PJs for Christmas. What kind of PJs did y'all do? I'm so interested, y'all. I'm a big PJ photo taker for every Christmas season. So because I have been into Star Wars lately, we did Star Wars um, theme. So y'all, these are my husband's PJs. Let me stand up. These are extra large. Okay. Look, this is what I'm accustomed to wearing, okay? These are my husband's PJs, okay? Mind you. I got my PJs enlarged and they fit me amazingly. You'll see in the photos because I'm gonna post the photos. I'm gonna post the photos, guys. Um, let me just take a moment and post the photos so you guys can see. Now, um, y'all, why am I more comfortable in these PJs? It's 
soon as he left to go to work this morning, out of the roof, his PJs on. And I'm so, this is my safe place. Is that weird? Like, this is how I have come accustomed to my clothes fitting. Like, super baggy, you know, like enough room for my skin to breathe. But it's not, it's not flattering. But in my mind, I can't get past the extra large clothes. So in the comments, tell me, what are you guys doing to gain confidence in your new body? Because I'm just not there yet. I am comfortable in these big clothes that hide my body. And, you know, I don't know. I'm just, I'm just not there yet. So if you guys can give me some advice and what you guys are doing to embody your new body, please let me know because I'm still in my safe place hiding under these large clothes, guys. Okay, now, before I get out of here, I just wanted to let you guys know, if you guys have not received your Sharps container, from Eli Lilly. I'm gonna put the link in my bio. I've been holding on to this information and maybe this is some information that you guys know. I didn't know about it. I only learned because I studied their website and came across the fact that we can order Sharps containers from them free of charge. I um, have one, this is my new one that I just ordered the other day, guys. It came in in like two to three days, like I ordered it and then the doorbell rung like literally it was a couple days um what i normally do is i just empty out the box and um i bring my sharps to work and i discard them there so that i can keep my fresh box so um yeah eli lily thanks i appreciate your concern for my family and myself and that's an amazing amazing thing i don't know if any other company does that but i definitely appreciate that in you guys so that's my spill for today, guys. I hope you guys have a wonderful, happy new year. I hope you had a very special Christmas and we will keep in touch and I will keep you guys posted on if I will be starting my new journey for the year, continued, continuously taking the Manjaro or if I have to start my new year on the semaglutide compound. Um, happy holidays. I'm gonna say goodbye to you guys for now. I'm definitely going to see you guys in my next video. Peace. Hi, I'm Keisha Dixon. I'm a lifestyle influencer, and I'm glad you found my channel. I post weekly videos, so make sure to hit your notification bells so you don't miss any of those future uploads.